video. Hello! Thanks for watching Let's Fill Text to Speech Generator Co video. <laughs> That's pretty funny. So last time we did an audio to text generator, and this time from the comments from the audio to text generator, uh, someone asked to do a text to audio generator, and some other comments said to do it in Python or Rust. So we can do the text to audio generator in Python, I thought this time. So um, from here, I'll op I have my terminal open and I have the package that I will use open. So just we'll make a directory called text to audio generator. So CD into text to audio generator. We'll go pip freeze. And I just to make sure we have virtual environment in our Python. Um, we'll say virtual in VMV, uh, virtual environment VEMV. Doesn't matter what you name the second part, but usually VNV is pretty good. Um, then we'll do source VNV bin activate to activate our uh, virtual environment. And then now you'll see that if we run pip freeze, we have no uh, Python packages. So uh, virtual environments are like uh, package JSON inside of um, Python, or it's just like opening a different book so none of your packages uh, conflict with each other. Um, from here, we're going to use P, uh, PY3 text to speech uh, 3.5. So, first thing I'll do is I'll say Ted, touch text to audio generator uh, dot py, um, and that'll be our Python file. Um, And then we'll split a pane down and we'll code like this half and half. Uh, so if we just go down here and we go vi text to uh, text to audio generator, I um, print text to audio. Uh, oops. Oops. All right. Huh? Let's up. We'll save it. Now, uh, Python text to audio generator, and it'll say text to audio right here, like so. So we go down here. Uh, next thing we want to do is let's just exit out of this real quick. Uh, we want to pip install py3 uh, dash tts. This is uh, text to speech. It uses a, uh, I think the new package is called pyts uh, ttsx3. But I had a bug earlier just installing that and seemed that this one will work. So originally. It was this PYTS TTS X3, but now it's PY3 dash TTS. So uh, the best part about this is it works offline and it's very simple and it has a lot of different um, configurations like uh, the current speaking rate, um, volume, and voice. Uh, so voices. Engine get property voices. Um, zero is a male and one is female. And you can also save voice to file here. So let's get started. Let's make sure, let's go pip install py3 minus tts. It's going to take a little while. So while that's going, we can read a little bit. So it says, if you get installation errors, make sure you first upgrade your wheel version using pip install upgrade wheel. And that's only if we have installation errors. Uh, we're not using Linux, so we don't need that. So the usage is import uh, pyttsx3 um, engine equals pyttsx3. We just init it, init it, and then say 
and it'll speak the text. Um, let me see if it'll work. So let's just wait. It seems like it's done installing. We do have a, a new release of pip is available. So let's run this. But I'll need to do that outside of my virtual environment, I think. I'll do it later. Um, so from here, we'll just vi text to audio generator. I think I have to fix that. All right. Um, insert import pyttsx3. We'll just say uh, we'll get the uh, user input equals um, input input text to turn into audio like this. And that'll ask in the shell um, uh, the user something, and then they could type something, and then that uh, what they type will be inside of this variable user input. It's like prompt in Node.js. And from here, we can say engine equals pyttsx, pyttsx3 dot init. Uh, and then we can say engine dot say on user input and whoops undo and engine dot run and wait so let's give it a whirl python python text to audio generator hello world my name is phil Oops. Enter. Hello world. My name is Phil. That's that. And it seemed like it's a uh, woman, uh, a female voice. So let's try to change it to a male voice. So maybe we can go here. Um, so when we after we init the engine, we can say engine. Um, uh, or First, we need voices equals engine dot get property property voices, and then we can say uh, engine dot set property um, voice, and we can say voices. And we can turn it into a male because it was just female and dot ID. And what else do we want to do? I think the volume is already pretty high. And I think the, uh, um, it was pretty fast. So let's slow it down. So rate equals engine dot get property rate. Uh, engine dot set property on rate setting up new voice rate let's just do it to um 75 and let's give it a let's try it out python text to speech generator hello thanks for watching let fill uh text to text to audio generator uh, tutorial. I don't know if it's a tutorial. Code. Oh, we do have an error. Name voices is not defined. Did you mean voice? Uh, so it says on line nine. Engine that name voices is not defined. Oh yes. Uh so let's go. Oops. Voices. Oops. Voice. Oh. Let's go. Voice. Uh, where am I? Ah, I'm just going here. All this voices. I think that should work. 
Hello, thanks for watching. Uh, uh, let's fill text to speech generator or video. Hello, thanks for watching. Let's fill text to speech generator to video. Man, <laughs> that's pretty funny. Let's go. And twenty five. I think rate means speed. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Okay. Thank you.